First National Bank has teamed up with the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports and the Ministry of Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology and Vocational Training in the staging of Island Champs, the premier track and field event that brings the finest school athletes together in competition. The parties held a joint news conference Tuesday at the conference room of the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports to announce plans for this year's staging of Island Champs. Mary Wilfred is the Permanent Secretary at the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports. We are confident that our partnership will be sustainable with our new corporate sponsor, and we look forward to greater mutual benefits with all our stakeholders. The ministry wishes to assure that we are striving to provide the best enabling environment for our athletes to thrive and to obtain global recognition. Our desire is to continuously improve and by God's help, with the return of the George Audlion Stadium and its recertification as an international track, we will regain our equilibrium in our strategic direction for track and field. Acting Deputy Chief Education Officer Cyrus Sipal noted that sports is being given much more prominence in the overall linkage with education and is now taking on a whole new perspective. We look at sports not as a pastime anymore. We look at sports not as it used to be done sometimes as a punishment. You boy, go and run 10 times around the school. Okay? But in sports on the hill, as was mentioned, of the success of Julian Alfred, will continue to be featured not as an event, but we want sports to be, as, to be seen as a career path and as a lifestyle program. So therefore, yes, Island Champ, it is picking up steam. It is picking up momentum. And then we will see that one day event as a major program. Managing Director of First National Bank, Fletcher St. Jean, disclosed that the bank is committed to playing its role in the development of the nation. This is now another great opportunity for us to really resonate, right, and put our imprint to us as an indigenous bank. We are serious about building our community. We are serious about investing in our people. And who more so to invest in than the young people, right, to let them know that, listen, First National Bank, like our tagline says, is literally here for you. We want to build that relationship early. Right? We want to invest in education, in our people, in sports. I like what Mr. Sipal did say, that sports is no longer about a punishment or pastime, right? It's now ingrained in the education system in St. Lucia. So, you know, we are pleased and we are humbled to be a part of this initiative. You know, we are a community-oriented bank, and we are pleased about this partnership with the Ministry of Sports, the Ministry of Education. And again, um, thank you for having this discussion with us, and this partnership will be a fruitful one, you know, uh, into the future. Island Champs will be held on March 17, 2024, at the Sufra Mini Stadium, which will be an afternoon affair of strictly finals on the tracks. Preliminaries will be held on March 13 and 14 at the George Odlam Stadium. First National Bank made a presentation of $100,000 towards the staging of this year's event. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.